What's up, guys? Are shorty headers better than stock manifolds on your rim? All right, I have a stock manifold here off my 2017 Dodge Ram 1500, and I have JBA shorties for that application for that truck. And I got my caliper out, and I'm gonna measure a few things. Uh, manifolds better than shorties. Let's start measuring. First and foremost, the primary is on this header. I'm gonna measure here to here, here to here. I'm also gonna measure the exhaust outlet on both. So there is roughly about 36 millimeters. The, the manifold is about 31. This way, we got about 46 millimeter. And on the manifold, we got about 44, 45. So these are a little bit bigger than the manifolds, just a tiny bit, by a few millimeters, not much. I mean, these are great headers. They're beautiful. They're well made. Not these specific ones. These are actually leaking, but just for uh, discussion purposes. People think that when they're getting headers, they're getting higher flow, more torque, more horsepower. And I've heard a lot of people say that manifolds, that manifolds are just as good, if not better. Did you say you heard of someone with a thousand horsepower with manifolds? The diesel or gas? Gas. Gas. Hemi. Yeah, Hemi. I mean, people are running up to a thousand horsepower with manifolds. All right, now the exhaust hole, the outlet. The JBAs are about 52 to 53 millimeter. And the manifold is about 60 millimeter. So right down in there, we got a bigger hole, exhaust outlet on the manifold. It's almost about a quarter inch smaller on the JVA headers. Now you can have a big hole here all you want, but this hole, this exhaust port is, this is important. This is where the exhaust is coming out. You're getting not necessarily better flow, but as far as releasing exhaust, this hole is bigger than this one. And if you see my other video, I have a leak on my JBA, so I'm putting these back on. And I'm interested to see, performance-wise, on my butt dyno, if these will actually perform better than these. And these aren't aesthetically pleasing. I mean, they're cast, cast iron. They flake, they rust. I mean, these are beautiful. These are, these are great headers. They're good looking. Silver, ceramic coated. But... Ultimately, I think this is better flowing. Now I have a total flow, a high flow wide collector on my exhaust, I'll show you in a second. This is a bigger hole. Exhaust is coming out, you know, wide open throttle. Flying out, this is this hole smaller. This one's bigger, so you got, you're gonna have better flow. And if you come over here, I'll show you my high flow wide collector. And there is my high flow wide collector, total flow. <coughs> Helps scavenge the exhaust and gets it out where it needs to be. And I think with the manifolds, I'm gonna have actually better flow. And I'll be able to tell once they're in. My butt dyno. Another thing, your stock exhaust flange sits on your manifold from here to here. So it's a seal all the way around. A lot bigger. And on this JBA, it's just sitting about 3 sixteenths of an inch all the way around. So that's another good thing about manifolds is the leak here is sealed much better than on these headers. I definitely think the manifolds are better for an everyday vehicle just because this is probably the fourth set I've installed that have leaked. Well these are going back on and I, I got a funny feeling I'm going to feel a little more torque. I don't know. You're going to have more My peace of mind dino. not hearing exhaust. Yeah, leaks. I won't hear no more ticking. So in my opinion, are manifolds better? 
in this case, I'm gonna say yeah, and I'm not just saying that because my head is leaking and I had to take my manifolds off and swap them back out. Um, I'm a little upset, yeah, but if I knew that exhaust outlet was bigger on the manifolds, I never would have got the JBAs in the first place. I never would have got them. I would have stuck with the manifolds. Yeah, it sucks because I'm not in a full bolt on anymore, you know, the full bolt on, but you know what? I think ultimately it's a better idea to keep the manifolds on rather than getting shorty headers. If you're gonna get headers, you get long tubes. Long tubes are awesome. I used to have them, they're great. The power difference is, is a big difference. But I'm in Massachusetts and I can't have long tubes. They're cracking down and they have been. So there you have it. Manifolds or shorties, stick with manifolds. If you're gonna get headers, get long tubes. ARH make awesome long tubes. I wish I could throw a set on, but I can't. All right guys, hope you liked the video. Like it, subscribe. We'll see you next time. See you later.